Shalom, Israel. Most high Christ bless. I'm kept the guy. You are tuned in with 15 minutes with the captains. Hey, today's class is God a strong black woman? Damn. A lot of people think God is a woman, not just a woman, a strong black woman. Play those videos. But God creates life. Can a woman create life? So what would be the closest thing to God? The creator of life would be a woman. But of course a man, because they have muscle, would trick the rest of the world into believing that man would be in... If, if war and people fighting is the least smartest thing in the world to do, and that's men, men do that all day, it's the most destructive thing to do. It's bad for business, but it's good for someone else's, whoever's selling bullets. So if, you know, men been running this shit for a while and shit is fucked up. I would love to see what life looks like with women running things. I would love that. The allegorical story of Adam and Eve is a motherfucking lie because in science, science will tell you that the X chromosome is five times larger than the Y chromosome, meaning that the man is basically a genetic mutation of the woman. This is why we have nipples and can't produce milk. And this is, this is why our penises is basically an extended clitoris. Now, when you get this book right here called The Lost Book of Inky, it's basically about the beginning story of the Anunnaki. It talks about how the woman, she gave 2.8% of her chromosomes to create man. Now, we were put on this planet, the man was put on this planet to protect the woman. We wasn't put on this planet to to oppress or suppress her through, the, uh, through white supremacy and religion. Because all those things are predicated predicated on the patrilineal system. Now, now that you have uh, eugenics programs in, a, in a, uh, the private prison industry, you can now eliminate the the black man through uh, black genetic annihilation and through uh, eugenics programs. So once you eliminate the black man, you can now compromise and whitewash the black women. Once you compromise and whitewash the black women, you can compromise and whitewash the black child. Because once you control the child, you're able to control the next generation. And once you control the next generations, so on and so forth, it's pretty much the precursor to uh, black genetic annihilation. Now, let me get this water real quick. Take your time, King. <laughs> now, uh, westernized society and uh, under the guise of religion, Everything is predicated on a patriarchy, patrilineal system. But understand, considering the fact that the women in Egypt were the high house, everything was predicated on a matrilineal system, meaning that it was strength in numbers. So everything that we done, you know, this is why Egypt had 30 Denver. dynasties. Because like I said, when, when, the, when the whole civilization is based on a matriarchy society, you can build everything from the ground up. This is why they brought in religion, because... Like I said in the last uh, few videos, you do the etymology of the word Christianity, it means to crush the unity. What unity? The black unity. So all that shit that they be saying in the Bible, even with you know with Solomon's temple and saying that you know alchemy and uh, witchcraft and um, uh, hoodoo and voodoo, that's they all shit that we're it. supposed to be practicing. We're not even supposed to be practicing they religion they practice because when you do the etymology of the word witchcraft, it means uh, feminine energy, Wicca, Wiki. Okay, let me get some more water real quick. The person who sits on the throne in the heavens, the heavens being the cosmos, or the cosmological womb, the macrocosm to our microcosm. The ruler of the universe is not who you think it is. It is not a man sitting on a throne in the heavens. It is actually the great mother. And because we have been told this lie, this is the reason why a lot of people believe that a man can father a child or that the child is within the seed of the man and that women are just incubators, that there's no life within the egg. But understand that the egg is already a life form which needs a spark for activation. And that's exactly what the sperm does. It provides a spark of light to start the conception process. And with that spark, it also deposits DNA. 23 chromosomes which attributes to the child the life form that's already existing in that egg it is not the life form itself understand that the man is like the farmer who waters the plant so that the seed can germinate 
and life can begin growing. The farmer is not responsible for making or creating the seed. He just provides the water in which begins the growth process. That is exactly how the sperm acts. All right, all right, this, this is crazy. Beans. These people are idiots. This, this chick said, this, this, it's like the farmer that watered water the seed in the grass. That's, that's what the men know. What, what are you talking about? That was the seed comes from the man. You damn idiot. Genesis 126. We're going to dive into it. Genesis 126. Is God a strong black woman? Hell no. Genesis 126. The book of Genesis chapter 1 and verse 26. Go ahead. And God said, let us make man. Let us make man. In our image. No, let us make woman in our image. Let us make man in our image. That lets you know the us were men. Men. Christ. The angels. God. Men. Read. After our likeness. After our likeness. And let them have dominion. Over the fish of the sea. Go ahead. And over the fowl of the air. Let them have power, read. And over the cattle. And over all the earth. And you know what's crazy? Don't men have power over everything in the day, too? The man can humble any animal. The woman, on the other hand, hey, I seen this man. I know I'm trying to keep it to me. I seen this video where they ask women, would you rather be in the in a middle of the forest with a man or a bear? Everybody said, I'd rather be with a bear. Like, what the hell? What are you talking about? A bear will eat your ass alive 100% of the time. What are you talking about? Just that dumb woke society, what they call it, woke. Uh, we don't. And over all the earth and over every creeping thing that creepeth upon the earth. So God created man. Created who? Man. God created man. In his own Image. God created man in his image. That lets you know the image of God is a man. Genesis 2, 21. The book of Genesis chapter 2 and verse 21. Come on. And the Lord God caused a deep sleep to fall upon Adam. Mm -hmm. And he slept. And who? And he. And who? And he. And he slept. And he took one of his ribs. He took a piece of the man. And close up the flesh instead thereof. Go ahead. And the rib. And the rib. Which the Lord God. Go ahead. Had taken from man. From man. Made he a woman. Made he a woman. Come and, on. And brought her unto the man. Read. And Adam said, this is now bone of my bones and flesh of my flesh. Come on. She shall be called woman. Woman. Because she was taken out of of man. Exodus 1. The woman came from the man. Newsflash! The woman came from the man. Exodus 1 and 8. The book of Exodus. Watch this, watch this, watch this, watch this, watch this. Come on. Exodus chapter 1 and verse 8. Read. Now there arose up a new king over Egypt, mm -hmm. which knew not Joseph. And he said unto his people, Come on. Behold, the people of the children of Israel are more and mightier than we. Read. Come on. Let us deal wisely with them, lest they multiply. Lest they do what? Lest they multiply. So, Pharaoh, this is who uh, uh, Ramses, right? A new king over the earth. This is Ramses II, is it? Pharaoh came up with an idea on how to stop the multiplication of Israel. I want y'all to keep that in mind. Pharaoh had come up with an idea, a plan, a plot on how to stop the multiplication of Israel. Like, these dudes are growing. This nation is getting too big. Let's see what the plan was. Read on. Lest they multiply and it come to pass that when there falleth out any war, they join also unto our enemies and fight against us and so get them up out of the land. Verse 20. I mean, I'm sorry, verse uh, 15. Verse 15. And the king of Egypt spake to the Hebrew midwives, mm -hmm. of which the name of the one was Shipra, and the name of the other, Pua. Read. And he said, when ye do the office of a midwife to the Hebrew women, Watch this. and see them upon the stool. They about to give birth. If it be a son. If it be a what? If it be a son. If it be a man. Then ye shall kill him. Read. But if it be a daughter, then, shall sh then she shall live. Go back to verse 10. Verse 10. Come on, 
Let us deal wisely with them, lest they multiply. And it come to pass that when there falleth out any war, they join also unto our enemies. So how did Pharaoh stop the multiplying of the nation of Israel? By killing the man. That lets you know the man is the reason a nation multiplies. Not the woman. The man keeps the nation growing. Not the woman. That means the nation grows because of the man. Not the woman. The nation succeeds in numbers because of the man. Not the woman. Just how God said, let us make man in our image, our likeness. The creator was a man. The creator is a man. The creator. We create. We create. Let me say it again. We create. Just like our father creates. The woman don't create nothing. She carries the creation. Once the creator puts his seed in two. What, what's up, Azadai? Damn. Uh, Exodus 15 and 3. Good God Almighty. The book of Exodus, chapter 15 and verse 3. Go ahead. And it reads, For the Lord is a man. A woman. The Lord is a man. A woman. The Lord is is a man, a strong black woman, a man. Come on, of war. Read the Lord is His name. Proverbs three eleven. God is a woman. The hell is this? Proverbs three eleven. The book of Proverbs chapter three and verse eleven. Go ahead. My son, my son, despise not the chastening of the Lord. Go ahead. Neither be weary of His correction. Of who? Of his correction. Of his correction. Go ahead. For whom the Lord loveth, uh -huh. he corrected. Watch this. Even as a father. As a mother. As a father. As a father. As a father, the son mm -hmm. in whom he delighted. Damn. Matthew 6 That's and 6. That's right. Matthew 6 and 6. Even as a father. Matthew 6 and 6. The book of Matthew chapter 6 in verse 6. Come on. But thou, when thou prayest. Enter into thy closet. Come on. And when thou hast shut thy door. This is the words of Christ. Read. Pray to thy father. To who? Thy father. Thy mother. Thy father. Thy mother. Pray to thy father. The father gets things done. Come on. Which is in secret. And thy father. And thy father. Which seeth in come secret. On. Shall reward thee openly. Philippians 420. Yeah, There's a lot of uh, fathers in here. For some reason. Not one time they say pray to thy mother. Bring it out. Philippians 4.20. The book of, book of Philippians, chapter 4 and verse 20. Go ahead. Now unto God and our Father. John 14.23. There's only a few scriptures that I, I, mean, I can run the five-hour class. John 14.23. Uh, the book of St. John, chapter 14 and verse 23. Go ahead. Jesus answered and said unto him, if a man love me, he will keep my words. Read. And my father and my father will love him. And we and we will come unto him go ahead. and make our abode with him. Daniel 7 and 9. Daniel 7 and 9. People that hate this, they hate God. And they hate men. The book of Daniel, chapter 7 and verse 9. It's that Eve spirit throughout the earth where they say that the woman is over the man. That woman is God. It's the Eve spirit throughout the earth. But the men of the Lord are here going to set it straight. Daniel 7 and 9. I beheld till the thrones were cast down. Go ahead. And the ancient of days did sit. The ancient of days is before days. That means he created time. He's outside of time. Read on. Whose garment was white as snow. His garment was white as snow. And the hair of his. Of who? Of his. Of his head. Head Come like on. the pure wool. That means God was a black man. God was a black man. Not a black woman. A black man. Read. 
His throne. His what? His throne. His throne. Was like the fiery flame. And he set up on a throne. Read. And his will. His will. As burning fire. Colossians 1 and 12. The book of Colossians chapter 1 and verse 12. Go ahead. Giving thanks unto the Father. Unto who? Unto the Father. Go ahead. Which hath made us meet to be partakers of the inheritance of the saints in light. Read. Who hath delivered us from the power of darkness mm -hmm. and hath translated us into the kingdom of his, his dear son. The father and the son. Go ahead. In whom we have redemption through his blood. Through Christ's blood. Even the forgiveness of sin. Read. Who is the image? Who is the image? Of the invisible God. Christ is the image of God. Read. The firstborn of every creature. The man. Read. For by him, for by him, were all things created read. that are in heaven uh -huh. and that are in earth, uh -huh. visible and invisible. It says him. It says he created everything that you see and don't see. Read on. Whether they be thrones or dominions mm -hmm. or principalities, come on, or powers, or powers. All things Watch were, this. were created by him, by a man, and. For him. And for a man. Verse 17. And he. And he. Is before all things. Come on. And by him. And by this man. All things consist. All things created. So all praise to the most high. Is God a strong black woman? Hell no. What is the nation? Nation is family. Nation is community. Nation is men leading by example. Nation is women's support. Nation is children with role models. 